what you're looking at right now is actually right through the ice on the lake. See? It is that clear. It froze up that quickly. The ice is thick. It's about four or five inches where I'm at. That's our cabin. Um, just going to walk around a little bit. Actually, check out the, <clears throat> the pattern. Like, you can actually see weeds down here. Clean it off real good. Look at that. You can see weeds. Freaking cool. Bundled up right now, as you can see, I got my bomber hat on. This is kind of a staple of the north. But, um, yeah, there's already ice fishing houses out here. Uh, you can see <clears throat> there's a white one over there. And then there's a little black one. This guy over here just put his out today. But um, what I found really interesting was the people that were actually coming over here and already driving their big wheels and stuff on the on the ice but uh, like that's bad <laughs> you don't do that already you already see uh, some of the tracks in there I mean it's just plain too heavy so but that was a couple days ago so I mean those tracks are all iced over right now but uh, just figured I'd give you guys an update just say hi so yep I'm out here it's freaking cold and uh, it's near Christmas so happy merry holiday Christmas thing I don't know I offend everybody happy Hanukkah I don't care anyway have a great one so talk to you later looking for fish it's kinda neat about I don't know it looks like it's only nine ten feet deep out here right now so but I mean you can see this stuff clearly I'm looking at uh, what looks like a, a beaver log and well here just let's see so you can kinda see down there you don't get a real great picture but uh, yeah it's pretty sweet I'll go try to find some more spots see what I this is a different spot the ice here is about six inches thick and what you can see here well the camera sees it much better than my naked eye but um, you can see the other side of the glass, or the other side of the uh, <clears throat> the ice. So, I'm still, still out here. Not too much farther away from my other spot, but it, it's a good, at least, I don't know. I see barely some weeds down there. But, uh, it's it's got to be at least about... 15 feet or so down. I can't really tell too much, but uh, judging by where I'm at in the lake, that's kind of where it was where I go fishing. So, went over to one of my favorite fishing spots. Yeah, I don't see anything. So, out. You can see all these bubbles actually in the ice. Um, and it gives you a good gauge and how deep it is. Also, you can see this fracture running through the ice. But, um, I mean, again, <clears throat> That's my uh, that's my finger or my hand against this fracture. Probably goes down a good couple inches. Which, uh, if you're unfamiliar with lakes or been out on le on lakes or whatever, you, you always want to give at least <clears throat> two inches for a human being to walk on. And Dude, if I had ice skates, you could literally skate this lake. There just hasn't been any snow and it's just been cold. It's fun. This is just a blast. This is just friggin' sweet. <laughs> it's cold, but man, it's fun. Mom? Just for you, I made sure the ice is safe. <laughs>